Hey yo everyone, welcome back to some late night forger. Should I do an ASMR episode? That's not a question, I'm not doing it. Yeah, we're back. It's like 1 a.m. There's a slime. I'm not looking at the game right now. It's like 1.30 a.m. You know, gotta keep gotta keep the voice down a little bit. You know, it's a nice night to play some forager. I like to keep it peaceful out here, alright? What are we doing this episode? Um <laughs> I don't know. Plastic? Jeez, all right, you know what? I feel like we should do the great expansion this episode. The great expansion. Let's 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 get some islands. Plain and simple. You know what? Let, yeah, let's finish the desert. We're gonna finish the desert. And I think we're gonna oh we gotta do a quest too, don't we? Okay. Oh, I know how to do this puzzle. Watch this. Watch this. I know how to do this puzzle. Yeah, it's time for the great expansion. Let's finish up a bunch of uh stuff. And we need to get done. Boom. That was easy. Cough up the cash. We're gonna need the cash. Yeah. Let's get all the islands in the desert and then snow biome. Snow biome is next. I'm gonna do them in order of difficulty. I think it's you no know, the regular forest biome, desert, snow biome. At least that's how I feel how it is. Is this even desert? I think. <laughs> yeah, okay, it is. Oh man, it's this puzzle right here. Alright, so this puzzle. I do know how to do it. I figured it out. But we also did this in the beta. The same exact puzzle. And it's very confusing. Now, spoiler alert if you want to hear don't want to hear how to solve this puzzle. It's berries. You look at it and you're like, it's just a tower. But you see this right here? This little picture right here. Take a picture of that on like your phone or use snipping tool and put it on your other monitor or something. I'm gonna use my phone. And we're gonna use that picture to do this puzzle. Okay? So let's go inside. I'm gonna zoom in on this picture. Now you get a bunch of electric cubes slash conduits here. And now the goal is that picture outside. You're supposed to use that picture and you're supposed to light up the ones not, you know, lit up. The dots that aren't there. That's where you're supposed to put the cubes and light up everything. So it's not that bad. But like, I never knew that during the beta and I looked up how to solve this puzzle. And I thought the dude was just making shit up when I looked it up. I was like, what in the hell is this guy doing? How does he know this? <laughs> but now that I know, shout out to whoever caught this on stream. It was somebody on stream when we I was doing my stream character. Somebody's like, look at the, the front of the tower. Like, does that have anything to do? I was like, you're fucking right. The, the madman, the genius. Yeah, the puzzle is actually not that hard once you understand that. The music in here is pretty nice. It's nice and soothing, just like playing Forager at nighttime. You know what I mean? But yeah, I'm trying to kind of finish this playthrough. So you might see this, these episodes posted with some Terraria episodes every now and then. Which uh, I know you guys don't like it when I post more than one video a day. I'm lying, by the way. We need to put this one like right. Pull this up. We'll just drag it over here. It needs to be right here. Yep, and then we need last one right here. Can I just do it like this? I bet I can do it like this. No? <laughs> I thought I was going to be able to do it like that. I know you can cheese this puzzle with a uh, thunder strike. I did a little bit of cheesing uh, on the stream. I had thunder strike just turned on and it was fucking up everything, but then I ended up just beating the puzzle, even though I wasn't like finished setting up everything. So it's kind of useful. There you go. That's not it? One, two, and then one, two. Oh. What? <laughs> I mean, maybe it was like processing that I'm a genius and I did it that quickly. I don't know. But yeah, let's go ahead. Get all these goodies. And we get, look at that. We get a nice little astronaut thing. And we get a spirit orb. Uh, I will use spirit orb on my energy. Let's do that. I think we should max out our energy as, fat, as soon as possible. It's probably the goal. But yeah, there you go. Puzzle's done. Simple as that. Simple as that. 2400 for the next one. I don't know how many puzzles we have left. Did we do the dungeon? I think we did the dungeon, right? Did we? <laughs> I don't remember. Yeah, we did because we have the, the lightning staff. Okay. So we're good on that. But yeah, I'm going to try and split episodes up into like certain paths. Uh, for example, you know, we have this episode. Great expansion. We're trying to expand everywhere. And then we're going to have an episode where I dedicate the whole episode to just finishing the museum. 
stuff like that you know maybe have an episode dedicated to me just building a bunch of structures because you know it keeps my mind nice and soothed when we stay organized like i don't think i have ocd i don't know how you really like figure out that you have ocd like sometimes things can be messy and i won't be like or things are messy and i'm like i don't give a shit <laughs> it can stay messy purple pigment don't we need this or something let, let me check the museum and that's where we're gonna save a whole episode for the museum let me check is some purple pigment used in one of these purple pigment is either used in one of the museum things or it's for something else it is for something else though okay good to know we should build multiple shops that's that's something that's like really good to do just in case the shop has some stuff you want to buy but yeah let's go ahead let's sell just some gems i guess sell like 10 of each another good thing to sell crystals let me just just sell all the crystals we can always get them back wheat sell all the wheat we don't really need the wheat right now and we're chilling i need to make a vault i think I have enough to make a vault because I think I was planning to make one before. Yes, perfect. No, I probably would have been smart if I put the vault stuff behind this. I like to put the vaults where they're hidden. I said that in the last episode, I think. Let's look at skills. What can we upgrade? What can we upgrade? Craftsmanship unlocks royal steel. Do we need that yet? We do need that if we want to do the princess's quest. The thing is with her quest, she kind of gives you garbage, but uh, it might be worth it. Is this? I'm trying to think here. Hmm. Let's yeah. Let's get craftsmanship. We'll get craftsmanship. I don't know. Should we get mining rods and quarries and just knock that out of the way? Get some auto farming going. Probably. But we'll we'll see. I've never done like actual farming in this game. But I know like a big farming update is coming out. I know there's like a farming update plan, a combat update plan. I'm hyped. And that's why I kind of want to beat this game kind of quickly. So we can, you know, wait for the big content update to drop. Like, I don't want to be playing this game during content updates dropping. I don't know, I'd feel disorganized doing that. I want to play it, beat it. And then when the new content update drops, you know, you separate the DLC from the, you know, the base game. Yeah, I'm hyped for content updates. This game seems like a game that can have some really good content updates. So that's going to be Major Pog, as they would say in Twitch chat. Well, I'm sitting right here. I'm waiting for this. Yes, there you go. All right, so... How much money do we have? We have 5.96k. Let's go back down here. And let's go ahead and buy this. This should be the last piece of the desert. Yeah. That's the old man. What does he want? I don't even remember. Because I did do most of this stuff. Like I said, on, on Twitch, I mount, I had a Twitch character that I stream right now and then. Uh, follow my Twitch, twitch.tv TV slash, I said that wrong. Twitch.tv slash gamers101. Not twitch.dv, whatever the fuck I said the first time. Uh, make sure to follow my Twitch. Catch me playing that character. I will post the videos eventually. I think... I don't know. We'll, we'll post the Twitch playthrough eventually on my YouTube. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. What the fuck? He just gave me poop. My bird friend told me about the existence of golden eggs. In all my years, I've never seen one. I would sure like to, though. So we just gotta find him a golden egg. Only someone was young and awesome and find one for me. I got you, my guy. You better give me something better than poop, though. You give me fucking poop. Now, here's the problem with the golden egg. Uh, it's rare. And not only is it rare, it is also used in the fossil stuff. So, I don't even think... Should we do that quest? How, how many chickens do you think I'd have to farm to beat this quest? I don't know. Probably a lot. Too many. Is this desert? No, it's not desert. This is desert. Can I buy both of these or just one? Just one? Okay, I bought a good one at least. We're gonna use our lightning here to our advantage. You can see us. Uh, <laughs> ooh, that was close. Ooh, steel? You boys are a good way to get steel. You know, since they're a good way to get steel, I can reach him from here? I can't. It's pretty fucking OP. But yeah, since these guys are a good way to get steel, would it be smart to just go in and out of the desert uh, dungeon 
and get steel like that? Hmm. I don't know if they respawn. That's the thing. We, we might have to put this theory to the test. Might have to. Look, this one's on a little, like, tile. Come on. Wow, thanks for the bones. Need a key. Oh, shit. Yeah, I forgot. Uh, I know there's an item we get in the future that's, like, infinite keys. So it would probably be nice to get that as soon as possible. No, not really, because that means we have to explore a new area. I can just make a key, though. Because in the last episode, we smelted, like, a million gold. Wait. Didn't I? S yeah, I smelted a lot of gold. Why the hell do I only have, like, four? Maybe you never smelt it. Maybe, like, I when I said I was going to go AFK at the end of the episode, I just left. That's 100% possible. Uh, I bet this is going to give me a spirit orb. I'm just, I'm just guessing it's going to give me a Yeah. <laughs> There's not enough unique passives in the game. But all good. Spirit orbs are useful, too. Boom. Energy goes up even more. Beautiful. I really want that crystal pickaxe. But we need plastic and stuff, which requires a lot of machinery and a lot of leveling up. I mean, we can level up pretty easily, but let's put our theory to the test. Our ancient home theory to the test. We're going to see if we can farm those electric dudes here and then just leave. Not this electric dude. Uh, are the other electric dudes even in here? I don't know. Where oh, shit. Yeah, they're there. <laughs> right. Am I hitting him at all? I am. It's barely doing damage. Oh, they just drop iron? I mean, I guess it's a good way to farm iron. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave off of that. Yeah, yeah it's a good way to farm iron. <laughs> Not much else. But yeah, I'm gonna do some off-camera just mining. Try and see if I can get a level and get a bunch of money by selling gems. So I will see y'all in a second. Alright, we're back. I farmed a level. Farmed a bunch of money. Took like two daytime cycles, whatever, nighttime cycles. We're good to go. Is this automatic, 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 crafted items collect themselves? Yes. Let's get this. So we're going to get this and then we're going to get quarries, 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 it's quarries. Um, and then we're going to just have an automated area somewhere so we can reel in some free XP and some free ores, which is always good. Even some free money by selling some gems. Yeah, let's buy the last, I think this is the last island. Yeah, it has to be. Oh, oh this one. This is a puzzle, right? I don't know. <laughs> Pretty sure it's a puzzle. You just, you just, you just, you just, uh, you just, just, uh, shock it a little bit. Uh, I don't know. You know, I did solve this puzzle without actually doing anything. <laughs> I just solved it. That's all I remember is I just solved it. Hmm. Maybe you have to do something at daytime. Cause we have the puzzle in the desert where you have to do something at nighttime. But let's go talk to her. Where's she at? She's down here. We haven't done her quest yet. It does require us to get royal stuff. That's the main reason I try and duck it. Lovely to meet you, friend. My name is Anna Banana. It's hard being a princess in the desert. No flowers grow here, a flowerless princess. You can just like walk over to the forest, it's not that far. It's absolutely, uh, Jesus, it's absolutely awful. Think you can help me here? Oh, how many, 40? I don't know, that cactus is in the way. 40 flowers, that's no problem. You wanna like cough up the golden egg? I, we got the golden egg in the uh, beta playthrough. And I just have not seen one since. <laughs> they just don't show up anymore. Even in the stream playthrough. Okay, we'll, we'll figure out. We'll figure it out later. I'm assuming when we set up a farm, it's gonna be easier to get a bunch of stuff. So, I don't know. I might have to look into farming stuff. I might have to grind out a couple levels. Those a problem. Come on, come on, drop it, drop, 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 drop. Golden egg, drop it. No, okay. It's all good. It's all good. I don't want the golden egg yet. How many flowers? You got 68. Is that not enough? What should I do? Let's see. Let's see what cat? This is what I'm eating. This should be enough, unless she wants 400. Okay, I was about to say, there's no way she wants 400. You are welcome. These people did it. Well, I don't know what the fuck I just said. I hope you like animals. This will help you find more of them. So she's going to give us Anna's delight. Uh, something to help you. <laughs> I can make a rare form of clothing that will make animals love you forever. Bring me the materials and I will make it for you. So she wants two royal 
cloth. Is that what that's called? I think that's what it's called. Roll cotton or something like that. So to make that, we need to go over here. Roll, roll clothing. You just need leather and then gems and threads. So it's not too bad. Wow, we have no fucking fiber. What the hell? So this is another uh, quest we did in the beta. I think it's the same exact reward. It's like a robe or some shit. Oh my god, I forgot that we need a key. I completely forgot. It should just take a second to make a key, honestly. But yeah, as you notice, I don't really level up too often. Well, I guess it, it seems like I level up a decent amount. But there's a lot of work that goes into leveling up. It gets extremely grindy. But there's obviously ways to automate that as you go in to the game or go further into the game so i'm not too worried right now we are gonna have to min max something soon so i feel like we need to start getting some levels we need to start getting some levels pink bow animals drop 25 percent more resources and spawn much more often thank you now i am shovel knight but with a pink bow in my hair i still don't know how to do this thing up here i, I have no idea <laughs> Did like a like a hiccup burp right there. You get hit with a pickaxe. Uh, <laughs> figured it out. I remember what we did. We shot it with a bow. I didn't look up my footage or anything. I completely remembered off the top of my head. Wait, wait, you gotta charge it up. Boom. That not it. There we go. Shot it twice. Of course, we need another key. Oh, I saw that. I should try and dig up everything I can just to see if we can get a fossil. That would be very nice. A fossil would help out because uh, I don't have any fossils yet in that fossil collection area. That's probably going to be the hardest one for the museum, I'm assuming, because everything else doesn't seem too bad. The fossil ones this seems pretty hard. But yeah, let's go ahead. Let's pop this baby open. What we got? It's actually an item. There's a 35% chance to dodge attacks, okay? That's everything, right? That's the whole desert? Is this... I don't know if that's... Snowbind. <laughs> four? It's four. This, this four, five, six. It does go down two more, doesn't it? Oh my god. Wait, does it? I, I'm confused right now. Oh, there's so much shit in the way. I don't know. <laughs> I I have no idea, honestly. They cost so much. I can't really afford them right now. I mean, let, let's just check again. What's the cheapest one? I think we're done with the desert, though. I'm, I'm not 100, though. 14,000. Can I get 14,000 easily? Not really. It's not like a cheap price or anything. I don't know. Maybe we just have to level up again. It might be the goal right now. Golden egg. Golden egg. Golden egg. No, okay. Yeah, maybe just level up would be the best choice. A good way to level up is these crystals. You get 24 XP and plus they can give gems and stuff. So I guess I'll see you when I level up. Actually, I don't know because I'm going to set up a quarry when I level up. That's what I'm going to get with a skill point. And then I'm going to set that up and then I guess I'll show you guys from there. All right, so I want to try something here. Uh, I know the quarries, they spawn in ores, obviously. Now, what happens if I put them in a snow biome? Does it spawn in... Uh, what is it called? Does it... Can you not be right there? Does it spawn in uh, crystals? And do mining rods also mine crystals? We're about to find out, I guess. I don't know how often they even spawn stuff. I mean, we can always break it. It does spawn in crystals beautiful beautiful so now our goal is to make mining rods which we just need brick how, how much is it for how much steel is it we should be able to make multiple if we just make a good bit of bricks let's do like 10 and 10 and boom we, we got our auto farming business set up and they also auto pick up i'm pretty sure like all the ores and stuff auto pick up uh, i don't know if that's because i have the skill or if they just do that already i don't know did not mean to drink this thunder arcs off me well now you guys get to see what this does uh <laughs> not mean to drink this at all but hey it's a good farming thing except for you gotta actually like pick stuff up 
Uh, don't worry about it for now. Oh, don't go up there. I don't know if this hurts turnips or not. But, uh, it's all good. I was just trying to pick up the fairy. It's kind of annoying having this on. <laughs> Is way to cancel it? No, you can't. I mean, I guess might as well start farming stuff. Alright, the lightning strike finally wore off. <laughs> it's like four or five minutes later. I did get a good bit of XP. As you can see, my XP bar, or my XP went up a lot. But let's do it. We're going to place one just right here in the middle. Is this good? Maybe right here? Boom. Now these things, honestly, a little bit slow. They could be faster because this is actually a perk that you get that makes them faster. And also it's good to just get more because I think the more you have, the more power or some shit like that. I don't know, something like that. The more damage it does. But uh, there you go, there's my, there's my farm. <laughs> that shit, that's our passive income farm, as you can say. Uh, we'll just have that sitting there. But I think, I think we should end this episode off here. We accomplished a lot. And, uh, you know, I feel, I feel like it's a good ending point. In the next episode, we'll go ahead and continue our beautiful adventure. Through Forager, full release edition. <laughs>